God damn. So fucking embarrassing, man. I'm trying to do practice my I'm trying to practice my dang dog bark and these people are out in the front yards at fucking seven in the morning, man. How am I supposed to practice this shit? God. Anyway, I mean woo, woo, woo. Anyway, like I was saying, how am I supposed to practice that if it's, you know, people watching and stuff, man? Damn. Can't, you know, perform in front of people like that. Jesus fucking Christ. Woo! Woo! Oh. Well, I hope you're all having a good day today. I'm getting ready to, the reason I turned the tape on this morning because I wanted to show you the llamas. The Trinity Llamas. They're so, so daggone fucking special. I mean, it's the only part of my day that makes me stop and go, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> no, they got all kinds of farm animals out here. Uh, damn it. Clean help. They're not out here. I, I, kn I knew there'd be a letdown like that. They're really not out here, seriously. That's where they, those are goats. Oh well. To hell with the llamas. Uh, it feels really good out here today. It's like, it's like daggone fall or something. We just had four straight days of of uh, rain, continuous rain, and flooding, flooding of all low-lying areas. And uh, 17 people died on my street alone. Uh, so, I don't know if you have been watching the news, but I know uh, a, a retirement home flooded and uh, 16 no, it was 17, that's right. 17 old people died in the retirement home. But uh, they all died before it flooded because uh, one of the old guys, one of the old guys' uh, diapers got stolen by one of the other residents. And uh, it was, what, what the police uh, figured out was that uh, the reason his diapers got stolen was that uh, this older lady had a, uh, had slept with his best friend and uh, her dentures her dentures got stuck up his ass because she took him out to give him a blow job and he rolled over and they, they he just landed on them just right and uh, they went up his ass and when he screamed he came the other guy came out it was a big misunderstanding and uh, she couldn't take the the noise and confusion and in her fear and haste she uh, pulled out a gun and, and massacred the entire retirement home and uh, then it flooded so like needless to say it was confusing for the police to, to try and dig through it but it flooded after that and and uh, washed most of the bodies out to the river and they they clogged up the dam they all kind of got in a bundle and then clogged up the dam and uh, overflowed the dam and uh, it, it kept raining and the entire town of Trinity flooded and uh, but those were only 17 people that died over the age of 80 uh, the rest the, the rest of the 60 69 people that died uh, were all under 80 uh, most of them were police and firemen that died in uh, an effort to try and try and uh, get the, the mayhem under control 
and they all were in a big crash. It was a pile up and there was a fire and uh, and then a tornado, but all that's for later. I really can't talk about any of that uh, on camera here, YouTube. But uh, anyhow, I'm, I'm almost done. But I did want to say that I'm thankful to everybody who has been watching my YouTube channel and sending me money. And, uh, and I'm thankful for everybody who has uh, been buying my music because it's, I put it up for sale. I made some cassette tapes with my recorder and I set out a stand by the road uh, with a little table that I got at a yard sale. And uh, as of this week, I have sold two tapes for uh, 70 cent a piece. And uh, for those of you out there who bought them, uh, Henrietta and uh, and Terry, uh, I've got your nickel change if you want to come by and pick it up from the house. Because I know I told you I'd give you that nickel, but I had to wait until payday, so... That day's come, and I do have your change. Never let it be said that I'm a dishonest guy, that I don't pay what's rightfully due those who, who uh, I owe change to. That's the kind of musician I am, and the kind of kind of husband and, and wife I plan to be in the future, or husband, excuse me. The kind of wife that I'm looking for is one who will support me in my in my uh, musical endeavors and in my endeavors to better humanity and especially in the Trinity and High Point area I'm starting an outreach program next week to benefit stray dogs uh, what we're gonna do is um, I've, I've bought two shotguns and I need a partner uh, that's going to help me in this, but what we're going to do basically is um, round up the stray dogs and uh, and uh, let them loose in Sofia. So that's going to we're we're going to use the shotguns for anybody who tries to stop us uh, and tries to you know make trouble, saying that we're you know trespassing or whatever the case might be this this problem's got to be dealt with it's the only thing because these stray dogs are running around biting little kids everywhere i mean it's happened probably twice this this past decade and i think that's enough to warrant uh action on our parts as citizens i think that we need to get our guns and, and that's just for our personal protection you know we got to round up the dogs we got uh, trash bags for that we're going to tie them up in, uh, you know, in trash bags and then run them out to Sofia where they belong. So the thing is, uh, if anybody really has any kind of, uh, any kind of uh, assault intentions or anything like that, whenever we go out to, to do this, that's what the, the guns are for, except for our protection. And, uh, so I uh, hope y'all have a good day and applications for that position can be put in at 312 Rock Spring Road in High Point and uh, so y'all give that some thought and uh, have a good day like I said uh, have a nice day a good day a helpful day a productive day uh, a strong day a weekday and a uh, and a weekend and do all that today so see y'all later